What's up, YouTube? Kevin Walker, one, two, three. Finally finished uh, building my gaming PC. Uh, have a little look around. It's a Speco one case, a USB three on the front, which is quite handy. Can't really see it too well in the dark on the camera, so let's power it up. You've got the red fans in the front. It's a bit loud when you first boot it up because it's set to. Uh, run at the highest setting when it first boots up. Once it gets into the desktop it will go down like that. Well, went a bit earlier. But it's got set to performance mode, so because I've got it overclocked, so I don't want it to get too hot. Um, it's running a Z87 G43 motherboard with a i7-4770K processor, 8 gig of Crucial Ballistics uh, Tactical Tracer, which is running at 1866. As you can see flashing away there. Uh, Corsair H80i water cooling unit, which is quite good. Uh, had to put, if anyone's watching this and they're thinking about getting one, when you do it, uh, tighten it up to your motherboard before you put the actual heat sink on, check if it's loose, because if it is loose, you need some um, washers. I had to put two washers under each leg of the um, back plate, uh, so that was quite annoying. I had to do that. Uh, got the pallet edition of the GTX 770, uh, the overclock edition, uh, 600 watt Corsair power supply, that's plenty for what I'm using here, uh, standard, you know, big hard disk, uh, two Samsung 250 gig SSDs, and just a standard DVD drive, but it looks pretty cool, I've got one cathode at the bottom, um, the lights are coming from the top, uh, coming from the side actually, the uh, LED fans, then the lights that are coming off of the RAM, and then as you can see just, let me put my finger in there, that's the Corsair heatsink, uh, which is, you can set to different colours, so I'll set it to red as well, but if you notice, there's a blue LED in that uh, fan on the palette uh, graphics card, which I didn't know existed, and in my other computer it didn't even light up, so now I put it in this one, it lights up blue. But you don't really notice it that bad when you've got the computer running. It's not, you know, you don't see it that bad. It's not a big deal. Um, but I thought I'd show it off. Um, let me know what you think, if it's a good build. And it's overclocked to 4.3 at the moment. I haven't messed about too much. I only got it working a while ago. So I've got it to 4.3. And it seems to be running really sweet. So uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.